Hello 127th Wing and welcome to the September Drill. Today I'm filming this video from Finance where I want to recognize Staff Sergeant Raphael for all the hard work that he has been doing. Now as everyone knows one of the best things that, that you can do for an airman is to pay them on time and pay them correctly. Now Sergeant Raphael has been doing a great job to ensure that's, uh, that's happening every month. In fact in the last uh, quarter we've had over 34 people that have come uh, to the wing as new members and we have to get them in the system properly to get them paid and additionally hundreds I mean hundreds of arrows orders that come through the system to ensure people are getting paid correctly and on time the best thing you can do for an airman is to pay them on time and pay them correctly we don't want to underpay them and we definitely don't want to overpay them so with that Sergeant Raphael I want to thank you for everything that you're doing I'll give you my coin thank you so much appreciate yes, it sir. Okay, now for a quick COVID update. The wing is currently in health protection uh, condition alpha. So although in the local area, infection rates have been up and down over the last several weeks, we have not been seeing that uh, happening here at Selfridge, so we've decided to stay in health protection condition alpha. So what does that mean for you? Just the same things that we've been telling you every drill weekend. Please, uh, good hygiene, wash your hands, and above all, if you're not feeling well, don't come to work. Tell your supervision and don't come to work. I want to tell you a few things what the 127th Wing has been doing uh, over the last uh, uh, several weeks. I can't tell you how proud I am of the organization really getting after new warfighting concepts, specifically ACE or Agile Combat Employment. This last month, Northern Agility 22.2, which is part of Northern Strike, we uh, bounced A-10s all over the state of Michigan to do agile combat employment and integrated combat turns all across the state of Michigan. I mean, we did ICTs in Traverse City, in Grayling, in Oscoda, and Alpena, and then our tankers took uh, part as well in Oscoda and Alpena doing hot pit refueling and uh, all kinds of good things when it comes to ACE. So I appreciate all the work that, uh, that we're doing for that. Now that has gotten recognition at the highest levels of the Air Force. In fact, the staff at the Air National Guard Bureau says Michigan is really leading the way when it comes to uh, certain aspects of ACE. Additionally, the Secretary of the Air Force came to visit Alpena during our exercise to see what we were doing. Keep in mind, that's the second time the Secretary has visited the state of Michigan in a month. So it just tells you what we're doing here in the state of Michigan is getting recognized at the highest level. So with that, well done. Okay, now everybody should know that this during this drill weekend, we have our AMC and ACC inspectors here for our capstone visit. This is a big deal. This is our big inspection where they're going to look at everything that we are doing here in the 127th wing. So we have over 100 inspectors here from ACC and AMC. So I ask that when they're come to, they come to visit you, please show them the great things that you're doing. Show them your programs and be proud of them. So I'm looking forward to our results at the end of this inspection. I just came back from the National Guard Association of the United States Conference, which was down in uh, Columbus, Ohio. Every year, NAGAS recognizes organizations across the Air National Guard and Army National Guard enterprise. The 127th Mission Support Group was recognized as a distinguished uh, support group or mission support organization uh, for NAGAS this year. So I want to just thank everyone in the uh, 127th MSG for everything that you guys uh, did the last uh, year, all the great work, well deserved and well earned. Thank you very much. So really quick, I'd like to talk about uh, professional organizations. There are many professional organizations that we have that advocate for us. There's an old saying in Washington, D.C. that if you're not uh, at the table, you're on the menu. These professional organizations keep us off the menu and keep us at the table. So I just talked about the National Guard Association of the United States. There's others out there to include INGUS, which is the Enlisted Association of the National Guard of the United States. There's also uh, NAGM, which is the National Guard Association of Michigan. Air Force Association, or AFA. Tanker, I'm sorry, Airlift and Tanker Association, or ATA. These are all organizations that, uh, that advocate for us and what we do here uh, in our uh, military, in our Air Force. So I encourage all of you just to look and see what they are doing for all of us when you have the opportunity. It is our goal that the 127th Wing is the best led, most efficient, effective, and adaptable organization in the United States Air Force. I appreciate your leadership and I appreciate your professionalism.